It's been one month since a man's life was changed forever when a chunk of concrete from Highway 151 smashed through his windshield. He'll share his remarkable story only with News 3. That man, Kevin Droz, says he has little memory of what happened, but knows how lucky he is to be able to talk about it. Good evening, I'm Eric Franke. And I'm Sarah Carlson. Droz is sharing his story only on News 3, and reporter Mark Lovacott has his incredible story of survival. Sarah and Eric, Kevin Droz says he really went into survival mode. He knew something was terribly wrong, and he knew he was on the verge of death. Goes all the way from here, all the way around. Kevin Droz has no problem admitting he is lucky to be alive. His skull was shattered after a softball-sized piece of concrete flew through his windshield. I just pulled over, put my hand out, but while well, I'm bleeding bad, what happened? So the, I don't know. The moment you got the, the car got hit, you don't remember that? Or? No. No recollection of that at all. Droz says he tried to flag someone down for help, and when no one stopped... So at that point, I thought, you got to get going. And the only thing I could think of was Columbus Hospital. 20 miles he drove. All I did was keep my eyes on the road. Passing out outside Columbus Hospital. When he woke up, he was in Madison. His injuries were so bad, he was transported by med flight. The left side of his skull was crushed. There's parts that they couldn't piece back together. So there's like a, a credit card size piece of steel there and all. He was also left blind in his left eye. His road to recovery is a long one. He says some of the hardest healing will be emotional. I'm almost scared to, you know, be in a car, go on the highway. <laughs> I get real angry, yes. And Droz says he is angry because he feels that this should have never happened, not to him, not to anyone. He says the incident has left him unable to drive and unable to work. He is exploring his legal options. He says the road should have never been in the condition it was with loose concrete. And he says someone needs to be held accountable so something like this never happens again. A story we'll get an update on in the future. Remarkable that short a time ago, his physical appearance has recovered amazingly. He looks great for, for what he was been through the, you know, in the last mm -hmm. month and a half. So, yeah, absolutely. All right, Mark, thanks a lot. Thanks, you bet.